Hello everyone, welcome to another video. Today I'm going to teach you how to make a paper battle tank. This model is composed of three pieces, each one is made with a rectangle of paper. All parts are just fitted together and no glue is required. To make it easier to find the rectangles, let's start with an entire sheet of paper. I'll use a green paper for a better result, but you can use a printer paper without any problem. Let's fold in half. Just bring the bottom edge to the top. Now cut the paper on this crease. Now fold one of these rectangles in half as well, now in this position. And again, cut on the crease. Now take one of these rectangles and divide one side in three. You can use a ruler or just fold like that, as letter S. Having these marks, let's fold one third of the paper down. Let's cut it again and discard the leftover. With this, we have three rectangles with the correct proportion. Let's fold the larger one first. On the right side, bring the edge to the bottom. And make a diagonal crease. Now bring the edge to the top and make a crease again. Something like a letter X. Repeat the same on the left side. And now, turn the paper over. Let's fold in half each one of those squares. First the right side, just bring the edge to the end of the letter X. And the same on the other. Now undo both, turn the paper over, push the middle, and close like a triangle, bringing the paper like that. Now let's rotate in this position and fold this flap down in line with the middle. The other flap as well. Now rotate again and repeat on the other side, both flaps down. Now fold this corner to the middle and also the other one. Now fold this little flap on the bottom to the right side, in line with this edge here. Do the same on the other, more accurate as possible. Now let's open this little pocket here and fit this little tip, this little flap inside. The other side as well. And this part is ready. Now rotate the paper, 
fold the bottom edge to the middle, aligned with the last folds. Just watch and repeat. More or less like that. Rotate the paper and repeat on the other side. Now for the next step, turn the paper over, carefully bring one side to the other and fit the tips on these little pockets here, that way. Now slide the paper until the end, until the limit, and that's the result. Now let's flatten the paper, leaving the same amount in each side. Reinforce each side. And for the next step, turn the paper over. Let's fold the corners down, more or less one centimeter, like that. Try to do the same on the other three. And unfold. Now using the same creases, reverse each corner. folding inside. With this done, let's fold the bottom edge up, like that, and fold the other layers until this last fold. This one okay, now the other. Rotate the paper and repeat the same on the other side. Alright, this part is ready for now. To make the other, we'll use the second rectangle. First, let's fold in half, the bottom edge to the top. Now undo and fold both sides to the middle. First the bottom edge, and then the top. Turn the paper over and, like we did before, let's make a leather X. First bring the edge to the bottom, and now fold also this little corner here. Undo and repeat to the top, And do again and do the same on the left side, making a leather X again. Turn the paper over and fold in half each leather X. Unfold, 
turn it over and again as we did before let's close each side as a triangle and rotate in this position. Now fold the diagonal edge of this little flap to the middle, bringing the paper up, the same on the other, the left side, then rotate in this position, bring these folds up and fold the bottom edge to the middle. Now, rotate the paper, bring the folds up again and fold the bottom edge to the middle. Open the folds like that. And now for the next step, bring the right side, the larger fold, to the left. and fit one part on the other, the tips inside the pocket. Slide the paper until the end, and now just flatten. The second piece is ready for now. To make the last one, the barrel, you just need to roll the last rectangle of paper like a straw. I'll use a barbecue stick to make it easier. First roll in one direction, then the opposite direction. Very simple. This is the result. Now let's fit the parts, first the two largest. Bring up the two flaps of this one and close the other like that. Now on these two pockets we need to fit the two flaps of the other piece. Again just watch and repeat. Just fit like that, then slide the paper and open the part again. Now we need to open just a little bit this space, careful not to break. Then let's fit the barrel on this same space. Now reinforce a little, flatten in the paper, then turn it over and lift these layers, these little flaps, thus giving the detail of the mat. And with this done, our paper tank is ready! I want to congratulate all those who have managed to do and if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to click on like button and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much for watching and until the next time!